In this video, we're going to be talking about how Tommy lost his final canon life to dream in prison. Now, before we get into it, please make sure you are subscribed to the channel. If that button is still red, then make sure you do click it to make sure you are subscribed. With that being said, enjoy the video. Now, earlier today, Tommy booted up his stream titled Trapped in Prison with Dream. If you don't remember the last stream he did on the Dream SMP, then he went to visit Dream in prison to have a chat. And whilst doing so, somebody ignited a bunch of TNT on the roof of the prison, causing the entire prison to go into lockdown, meaning that Tommy was meant to be trapped in prison with Dream for the next seven days and today was meant to be the last day he would be stuck in there. Now the stream starts off with Tommy just being entirely annoying towards Dream. He's obviously using up this time with Dream to his advantage and going to make it a living hell for him. Now that inner state is paved with me- I'm making fun of you. Maurice of a past life I lived when I was 18. Tommy, please, I am trying to write. We also get to see Tommy's cat for the first time, and we know it's Tommy's because he can control whether it sits down or stands up. And well, the cat doesn't mean anything just yet, but you'll see how it means something later, sadly. Now after that, Sam arrives to the prison cell and tells Tommy that he might not be getting out of there today, because nobody knows what the security breach was. We heard there was TNT on top of the roof, but there was no obvious causes or anything like that done to the prison or around the prison. Can I, can you, can you, let me out. Oh, no, Tommy, you can't leave yet. I haven't found out what was causing the security issue. Sam. Sam, no, Sam. I know what I, know what I signed. I remember everything I've done ever. I'm like an elephant. Let me out, now. Now, after Sam and Tommy argue it out and discuss what Tommy signed in the contracts about him leaving after seven days, Sam leaves him alone with Dream, and Dream tells Tommy that this has been the best time he's ever had in prison, mainly because he's just not lonely anymore. And well, honestly, if you're in Tommy's shoes and you're hearing that your arch nemesis or the person you hate the most is having the best time being with you, well, that's going to make you a bit crazy and a bit just mad in general. And he, he goes and kills the one thing that Dream likes in the prison cell right now. That cat. Yeah. I guess because he can't have the boxing match with KSI right now, he had to have one with a cat. I don't know. Oh, what? You love him? Tommy, do you love listen. him? Do you love him? Yes, I do. You really like him, do you? Well, Dream, you won't fucking let me. Come here! Come here! Sit! But I think the cats are so dumb that ears are. This way. This way. <laughs> yeah, and that's what happens when you love something, bitch. You don't do that. You fucking. That cat was stupid. It would sit and whine and go, My name is a puss boy. I like talking about pussy and whining. It's fucking annoying, man, all right? See, now when I leave, when I leave, you'll have nothing because you're lonely and you're. M -m 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 oh, pardon me. Manipulative. We don't have any books left. Manipulative. You're a fucking twat. And well, I think the death of the cat really pushed Dream over the edge, and well, Dream tells Tommy that he has a plan to escape. The first thing that goes off in Tommy's head is that when he does escape, well, he's going to probably go and try and kill Tubbo, because that is the one thing that Tommy just really does care about. If Dream can't get to the discs, then Tubbo is the next option. Dream mentions that somebody he knows owes him a favour, and he'll be using that favour to get out of the prison, and then he will seek revenge. We know that that someone is obviously Techno, because they exchanged favours. But Tommy says to Dream that Techno probably won't help him because why would Techno want to go against somebody who owns the most powerful building on the server? That being Sam and the prison. I'll get my revenge. What does, what does that mean? It means that oh. I will get my revenge. You kill Tubbo. You kill you, you, you just, kill Tubbo. You kill Tubbo. You kill me. I have a what? plan. What is it then? What? Someone that owes me a favour, but that may be a part of it, but Dream then goes on to talk about how no one has killed him because he has this resurrection book that we all believe him to have, and that he has the power to bring people back from the dead. And this is where Tommy starts to laugh in his face and says that the book isn't even real. All of this time, everybody's believed Dream that he has this mystical book, but we've never had actual proof that he has it. And the only reason he's still around on this server and he hasn't lost his final canon life is because we suspect him to have this book. And Tommy goes to say that if anybody was going to have the book in the first place, why would have Schlatt had it to give to Dream? It doesn't make sense, and there's obviously lines which are missing, and we are kind of missing the whole point where Schlatt actually got this book. But Dream responds with he has no reason to lie about it. Dream says that he is God, and Tommy can't or won't kill him. And we see Dream take Tommy's final canon life away from him. What does that mean? If you can't kill me... Does that make me some kind of god? Does that make me hey, some kind me, of- Hey, that makes me fucking strong as shut up. No, Dream, I could kill you right now if I wanted to. Do you know why I won't? Because I'm I leaving this prison in a- Don't fuck it, I'm fucking- Stop you. it, stop it now, right stop now, it, stop actually. it, stop it. I'm on two hearts. Look at me, all right? The only reason I'm not is because I know you're in this prison and I, I'm gonna get my little scooter out and I'll be fine, Dream. You, you're stuck in here forever. 
I don't think this revive book is real. <sighs> Shall I? He's fucking dead. I've seen his grave. His grave is real. His corpse is there. Okay. All right. Why don't you go see him? No, stop, 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 stop. Now this means that Tommy is literally dead in the storyline and if it's anything like Wilbur that means he'll probably be turning into a ghost form or something like that. But why would Dream actually kill him? Well there's many theories I have which I'm probably going to discuss in a later video so make sure you are subscribed. But the main one I have a feeling for is that Dream is trying to prove a point with this resurrection book and in fact he's going to say that if the people let him out of the prison that he'll prove to everyone that this resurrection book is real, he will revive Tommy and then use his favour with Technoblade to allow him to escape from everybody. But let me know down in the comments what you think. Also go check out the videos on screen right now and go check out my other channel.